My name is Brenton Riddle. I'm a Gordon Leaders Program Fellow, uh, a graduate of the University of Washington, getting degrees in International Studies, Environmental Science, and the Comparative History of Ideas. My research and my work really has to do with how climate change and environmental science um, take place on the international stage. Um, one of my key interests is the China's Belt and Road Initiative and the social and environmental factors that are involved. Uh, I'd say one of my favorite memories of being in the Gordon Leaders Program was receiving the feedback and enthusiastic responses of the different guests that we would have come in at the weekly meetings. I just, it was really validating to see people take interest in what my interests were, which was the environment and how that takes place on the international stage. And so when people are working at it from an economic or political angle and then being like, yeah, this really is an important topic that isn't getting enough coverage. For me, as someone who's about to enter uh, the career and workforce, that was incredibly exciting because it made me feel confident about the decisions I've made in my academic career so far. And I decided to apply because I thought it would be a great opportunity to network with some professionals in the field, uh, connect with other like-minded individuals, and develop my understanding of U.S.-Asia relations. Yeah, I loved my fellowship experience. I remember when I was going through the year just receiving really exciting articles to read week, week after week. And pretty much what you would do is you would read that article and then you'd come speak to someone who knew everything about that topic. So any curiosity, any question that you had, you could ask them in a space that felt comfortable enough to like kind of question um, and get really insightful feedback. And what really stood out to me about this program in particular is the way that it would balance focusing on policy issues as well as reflecting on the leadership skills needed to enter the political sphere. One of the most influential parts of the program, of the Gorton Leaders Program, was learning from the legacy of Senator Gorton um, and those who knew him well. The Gorton Leaders Program and National Bureau of Asian Research gave me insight into the world of international political economic, economics and diplomacy from the perspective of practic practitioners rather than academics, which is something that you don't normally get when you're going through um, like your four-year degree at the University of Washington. It was incredibly valuable to me as I like look forward into building my career. After the program concluded, I still received the support of the Gorton Leaders Program uh, and its staff, Deborah, the president of the Slave Gorton Policy Center, connected me with her friend that does leadership consulting work, who I became a marketing researcher for. In other words, the Gorton Leaders Program and MBR have given me valuable connections. And I found the program incredibly exciting because it put me in contact with people um, with expertise that you rarely find in the classroom. In the classroom, you often find academics, people who have committed their life to doing research on a topic. But through the Gordon Leaders Program, you get to interact with practitioners, people who are having the conversations on like the floor of the House or the floor of the Senate or <laughs> wherever it is. So that for me was incredibly exciting 